Hey guys, today let's learn how to use or how to add the WhatsApp pass lock or pass key over on the WhatsApp web version. So all we need to do first guys is to go ahead and launch the WhatsApp web version on WhatsApp web or web WhatsApp. And then what I want you guys to do next is to wait for this to load and basically have your account or both accounts logged into the same account or both devices rather. And of course, we could also go ahead and try the same over onto the WhatsApp application on the PC. But in this video, of course, I'm going to focus on the WhatsApp web version. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and quickly scan this QR code so that I can go ahead and link these two devices, which is going to be pretty easy. All you need to do is to locate the QR code scanner on our WhatsApp application, and it's automatically going to be linked together and synced. So once this is already done, basically what we can do to access our settings is to tap on this three dots option, and let's try to tap on our settings option. Next, I could go ahead and tap on security or privacy to see if we can actually actually add that pass key. So first of all, I'm going to try security and see if it is actually located there. And in this case, I could actually go ahead and, well, see what the security options that I can go ahead and edit on the WhatsApp web version. As you see, we could also show security notifications on this computer. If in the case that security code changes for a contact's phone, you could also be notified about that. You could also see these options. But if you want to go ahead and tap on the option to see the privacy, and the most that we can do is to actually enable this option called screen lock. This is the option for us to require a passcode or a pass key to unlock the WhatsApp application. So I'm going to go ahead and try and enable this. And I'm going to go ahead and enter a quick pass key to, well, lock my WhatsApp application on the PC. I'm going to tap on OK once you have provided the passwords. And as you see, as soon as you could also set basically how long your screen will take time before it's going to be locked. So in this case, I'm going to choose whichever one you guys prefer prefer. In this case, I'm going to choose just one minute and it's automatically going to be saved now. And the next minute that you guys basically left the WhatsApp application, it is automatically going to be locked and it will allow you guys to provide the password first. So that's all for this video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please like this video and subscribe as well if you guys learned something. And I'll see you guys on the next video.